thank you so much, and welcome to the Spring 2024 concert. I'm Amy Holder, and I'm the principal at Casco Middle School. Before we begin, I do want to point out the exit and emergencies. So if there is an emergency, from there, here, and the boat in the back. Also, please take this as an opportunity to mute your cell phones. Um, a little housekeeping, please make sure that you exit between songs, and we do encourage everyone to please stay for the entire concert. I would also like to thank and recognize our superintendent of schools, our board of education, um, the collaborative and supportive high school principal, Mr. Shaw, um, all of the teachers throughout the middle school and the high school for supporting our students as they attend lessons and practice for this event, our maintenance staff for all their hard work to keep our facilities looking spectacular, and to the outstanding teachers who are making tonight possible, specifically Ms. Storrs, Mr. Dowling, and Mr. Geraci.
everyone, and welcome to our spring concert. Uh, I'm so pleased to be standing here in front of the seventh and eighth grade uh, chorus. You know, the, the, our very first song, I Want to Rise. Well, prior to this year, I used to have seventh and eighth grade rehearsal first thing in the morning, so I know what they look like first thing in the morning, and I'm sure we can all agree they really don't want to rise in the early morning. <laughs> but they did a beautiful job with that. So as you can hear, it was kind of um, it was a, a partner song. So we had I Want to Rise partnered with uh, Swing Low Sweet Chariot, uh, which is an uh, African-American spiritual. We are going to move on. One of the uh, things that I uh, tried to work with the group on this year, especially more so for uh, my eighth graders as they are preparing to go to high school next year. Um, you know, we're not ready for that yet, but it's coming. Um, I do a lot of language work in the high school, so I introduced a piece to the group that is entirely in Latin. So here is our version of Ani Stay. <laughs> Um, the mail can be a funny thing. Um, I'll double check my list 
and um, I can always send one home in person uh, with the student, but we did try to mail them out just to make sure they actually got home and in the parents' hands, which is hard for most school students sometimes. <laughs> we are going to finish up the seventh and eighth grade portion uh, of the chorus concert with a piece called Soulfish Sonata. Now, one of the things that I do a lot in my warm ups and working with the students on is something called Soulfish. We all are familiar with it, Do Re Mi Fa So. If you've watched Sound of Music, you all know that song. That's not this song. But well, we're going to take Mozart's Piano Sonata, which I promise you will recognize it instantly. I'm sure at some point in the evolution of cell phones, this might have been your cell phone ring. Um, <laughs> and we are going to add in a little bit of verbiage and a whole lot of soulfish. So here is our version of Soulfish Sonata.
On June 5th, our band will be traveling to Kingston High School to participate in Miss Money. This is a special event where we perform for two judges who give us a who give us valuable feedback and scores. We will be performing the two pieces you've heard so far, and then our next selection.
hot song of the evening. Uh, it is a Florida Georgia Line tune. The kids absolutely love this one. Why do they not love the pop song? Whatever. All right, have a good night, guys.
Good evening and welcome. Thank you so much for joining us tonight. We're very excited to be sharing our musical journey with us. Um, we love playing for all of you. We love getting prepared for all this, um, facing these new challenges. That last piece um, was called Mystery by Zach Walter um, and kind of sets the stage for the rest of our, our performance with a little bit of enchantment. Right? Um, that piece in particular requires a lot of concentration. Towards, especially towards the middle, you break all that repetitiveness. Being able to keep track of exactly where you are when you're doing the same thing over and over and over again requires a lot of concentration. Um, so they did an amazing job on that. Uh, I would also like to acknowledge our amazing percussion section, um, who has so many things going on out there. As well as uh, Evan Lindsay, our little soloist. That short little solo in the middle on the sax, and Lewis, uh, look, 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 And all right, so, uh, okay, our next piece. Uh, we invite you to join us on a nostalgic adventure uh, with our next selection, Arabian Nights, from the beloved Disney classic, Aladdin. Nice. 
But spring's always my favorite because spring is when we can really see the growth in all these amazing musicians. And when I look back to the winter concert and then see what they're doing now, it's just a huge improvement. So not only do they sound so much more together, organized, confident, but the stuff they're doing is harder than what they did at the winter concert. So they're doing better with harder stuff. Uh, so I, I love the spring concert because every, every time I'm just reminded how much work they put in. And thank you to all of you for putting in that work. I'd also like to extend a heartfelt thank you uh, to everyone who contributes to the success of these concerts, uh, our dedicated students, our supportive teachers, not just the music teachers, but also all the other teachers who allow us um, and don't give us all our time when we need to pull them for lessons, uh, our diligent administration, our hardworking custodians, and of course, each and every one of you who supports these students up here and allow them to do what they do. So thank you so much. Just a reminder, your presence and support ensures that music remains a vital part of our students' lives. Not just the enjoyment of it, but enriching them socially, emotionally, and intellectually. It has and will continue to change their lives forever. So that brings us to our last piece called Byzantine Dances by Carol Britton Chambers. Thank you so much for coming out tonight. Uh, and may the music carry you into a wonderful evening.